There is nothing I've found more healing than a deep connection with our natural world, especially in this modern society that requires so much energy to maintain. I'd love for you to join me on this outdoor oil painting adventure in my beautiful home state of Florida as we take some time to slow down and reconnect to our roots. I've struggled with a multitude of different health issues throughout my life, both physical and mental, as I'm sure so many of you can relate. And throughout these struggles, I've experimented with a lot of different healing modalities, but nothing has had as profound or as immediate of an effect as time spent in connection with Mother Nature. Mother Nature has taught me that health is earth embodied, and the more time I spend in healthy outdoor environments, the better I feel. So while I do absolutely believe that art can be a really powerful healing ally, I don't believe that art alone can heal us. We need connection with our surroundings, with the trees, plants, animals, waters, bacteria, and minerals that keep life on this earth circulating. And this is why I love to take my painting practice outdoors, combining two of my favorite peace-inducing activities. If you've been following along, you'll know that I've spent the past several months deep in a practice of figure painting through the Archetype series. Painting myself as seven different feminine archetypes took me on quite the journey of self-discovery. It was through the fragmentation of my personality, the seeing myself through multiple lenses, that I started to wonder who I really was. If I could be seven different women, then what does it look like when I'm not just one, but all of them at once? What does it look like to feel whole and complete? Throughout this whole series, I was asking myself this question, trying to visually summarize wholeness. It wasn't until I was painting the last archetype in the series, the wise old crone, that the picture of wholeness became clear. All this time, I was painting myself as the central focus exploring the I, the ego, the perception of myself through this body. And while each archetype taught me valuable lessons, none of them felt like they could truly convey who I am in totality. In search of a way to visually represent the wholeness of being human, I reflected on the moments in my life that I felt most whole, and a common thread started to emerge. I realized that I felt most whole when I felt a part of something much larger than myself. I felt most whole when surrounded by giant redwood trees, when I was swimming in an incredibly vast and mesmerizingly blue ocean. I felt most whole watching the sunset high up in the mountains, and when connected to nature, when I felt small in her presence so small that I became a part of the landscape itself, insignificant and absolutely in awe of the beauty that exists here on this planet. This realization has sparked so much creativity within me and I'm so excited to share that with all of you. There's a new series in the ideation phase that I'll be working on and sharing soon but in the meantime, I'm leaning on this connection to nature and practicing landscape painting in preparation for what's to come. I never used to pay much mind to landscape painting. I always found it more fascinating to create my own worlds, but this plein air painting has completely shifted my perspective. 
It's rare that I would spend two hours deeply observing one little spot in nature, but plein air painting made me look at this little path with new eyes. Deeply observing every little speck of light and shadow, every shape that the tree makes and how it's all connected. I feel such a profound connection to this spot and when I look at this painting, I feel a deep sense of peace. And I feel so lucky that I get to take that piece home with me and hang it on my wall. Art gives us the opportunity to bring the outside in, to feel a sense of peace in a chaotic world. When I walk past this painting, I'm reminded of that feeling of wholeness, and I feel a little happier, a little freer, and a little more myself, a small part of the landscape. The power of art is becoming more and more known to me, and I'm so incredibly grateful and humbled that I have the opportunity to create these experiences of peace, not just for myself, but for others as well. Health is earth embodied, and let's face it, most of us don't have the privilege of being able to be feral nature creatures roaming the magical lands that make up this planet. The modern world demands a lot of us, and we have a lot of work to do collectively to get back to a place where we can all live in harmony with nature. But thankfully, we have art. We have an opportunity to bring the beauty of nature into our homes, offices, and daily lives. And I truly believe that the more often we can create these moments of wholeness for ourselves, the more healthy and happy we'll become. Thank you so much to everyone who tunes in and supports this channel. Your likes, comments, and subscribes mean so much to me. It's a blessing that I get to share this space with you, so thank you, thank you, thank you. I will leave a link to my website in the description. There you can purchase original paintings, request commissions, and just get to know me a little bit more. I don't list paintings on my website right away, as I do have to wait several months to varnish them, but you can always email me if you see a painting 
that you like and want to reserve it ahead of time. Being a full-time artist is really a dream come true, and I'm so happy that I get to pour my love of art into this channel. I hope that you get so much value from watching these videos and that you use them to inspire and awaken your own creative journey. I'm sending you so much love, and I will see you very soon.